Sonia reaches out to his face and kisses him. He tastes sour, stale, and dry. She keeps at it. She lifts up her tank top and pulls her bra up over her chest, takes the young man's hands, and presses them to her tits. He bends down to suckle them, and she moans. Her nipples are so hot and painful, she almost comes right then, bucking her hips. He pulls back. I can't do this, he says quietly. Then he grabs her breast again, and she sits on top of him and grinds against his erection. It's a hard stick of a thing in his pants. Everything about this guy is thick and stiff. His rock-solid arms are around her body now, around her neck, grabbing her around her plump, pregnant waist. Sitting there on top of him, she looks down at her body, and it's all roundness, all cushiony flesh and ripe fertility. She's the Venus de Milo, the woman of all women, the symbol of fuck. She hoists herself up and starts the awkward undressing, the ripping, the just a minute, the I got it, I got it, the wait, not yet. First she's on top and he's inside of her and she can barely get him in, get, can barely get him all in. His dick makes her think of a huge pepper grinder at those fancy restaurants. <laughs> yes, waiter, I'll take some of that. She gets that panicky feeling, the get it in, get it in, oh no, can I get it in? He pushes her down on the bench and she stretches one of her legs over the car seat and wham, he's fucking her. Oh my God, thinks Sonia. I got it in, all the way in. The sense of awe and accomplishments brings her back to 14 when she was desperate to get it in there for the first time. One of his hands grips the dashboard, the other's underneath her on the bench. It hurts, in the good way fucking hurts. For months, she hasn't been able to look into Richard's eyes, her not dead husband. But for some reason, here in the dark with this stranger, she can take it. The stranger's eyes glow like a cat's in the dark. His mouth is loose and open. He stares right back at her and spits on his thumb, rubbing it at the base of her clit. This man knows pussy. He fucks her hard, his other hand on her hip bone. Her damp, swollen breast starts shaking, and she comes in that blind way where she can't see anything but white light, an electric current slamming her head against the door. She's fucked right, of her, right out of her own body, panting. It's so awful, it's so right, to get fucked in a truck on the side of a highway by a man who doesn't give a shit about her, about what's for dinner, about their social life, about how the kids are. 